What's up guys? Okay, today we're going to be reviewing the new chapter shoe from Warsaw. This is Jamie Thomas's new company. Shout out to Jamie. He's been in the game forever and I just love seeing people, you know, tr bring new things into it. So shout out to him. And uh, yeah, I ordered these online the other day, not sponsored by them. They didn't, you know, send me any shoes or anything like that. Just was interested in the new project and wanted to try them out. So order the pair. Not even sure exactly what these look like. Um, I just went on the website and saw that these were the ones closest to what I ride. Right now, I've been riding these on and off for years. Buzenitz, I think these are Buzenitz 2s. I go back and forth between the 1s and the 2s. So, um, yeah, these are black and white. Pretty simple, straightforward shoe. So, yeah, um, I actually haven't opened the box yet or looked at them. So, let's check them out. Nice, comes with some stickers. Oh yeah, look at that. Looks like from the man himself. Hi Chad, thanks for your support. Love, Jamie Thomas. I think, I'm not good at writing script, but I'm gonna guess that's the guy in the photo. You got this uh, Ed Templeton card that came with it. That's pretty cool. Collaboration. Yeah, these look really nice. I could tell immediately holding them that these they feel like they're high quality, really nice suede, smooth, a little bulkier than I'm used to. Um, these shoes tend to be a little thin, but my feet are always hurting me, so we'll see how it feels. But I think the, the sole might be a little bit thicker than these Adidas I've been skating. But yeah, curious to see how they feel. My main concern with a shoe is like, I want my feet to be okay and not in pain, but I want the most board feel as possible. So. It's a fine line. I'm always bouncing back and forth between, you know, a little bit of a thicker shoe and something thin. But um, yeah, I mean, these feel immediately like they got some give to them already, which is good because I like being able to hop into my shoes and skate them right away. You know, I like them feeling broken in. So I'll wear them around for like a week or two and just feel these already feel like they got some good movement yeah let's uh throw them on and do some skating okay the first thing i noticed right after throwing them on is that they fit much differently than the adidas ones these feel softer kind of thinner on the the sides and it forms more to my foot whereas with the adidas i feel like they were a little bigger than my foot and I was kind of always sliding around in there. So these are fitting nice, uh, a little, like a little bit more snug. I'd say they're pretty true to a nine and a half. If anything, a hair on the smaller side, but that could just be from, you know, them being like brand new and also that form fitting thing I was just saying. But uh, yeah, I kind of like that actually. Cause I was always, you know, my feet get sweaty, you're skating around, and I don't like that once they get broken in, your feet are moving around too much. I'm always like cranking the laces tighter. So um, yeah, they feel pretty comfortable right now. All right, let's cruise around and get the legs warmed up a little bit. All right, legs are warm. Let's see if we can pop the board a little. Almost went down. All right, still haven't flipped my board in these shoes. Gonna try to get five flip trick to stalls on this quarter pipe right here. Oh, almost first try. All 
All right, maybe not five. Can't even get one. Yep. Yeah, rebate on that one. Yep. Knew that was gonna happen. Went for it anyway. I, I think that's gonna be it for the skating today because I just cracked my truck in half all the way through. I don't know if you guys could see that, but yeah. So I think that's gonna be it for the skating today. But for the shoes, I love them, man. They skate incredible right out the box. They feel broken in. I thought the sole would be a little too thick. Feels really good. Everything feels really good about it. So I'm stoked on them. Uh, I believe they were 95 bucks. I'm not sure, I think that's like the going rate for the main skate brands now, like Nike, Adidas. Um, I'm kind of out of the loop on that, so I don't know. But um, yeah, these definitely worth the money. They skate really good. If you only care about like quality and how they feel, I love these shoes and I'll probably keep skating them. One of my favorite parts of them are that there's no design. There's no like blatant logo like right in your face you know it's just super simple a couple stitchings here and that's it nice plain black the way i like it one other thing i had mentioned before was this tongue it's shorter than the tongues on the adidas i'm used to they usually come up higher which i thought would like just feel weird maybe dig into my foot or just i don't know not feel the same didn't even notice it also it's kind of like a leather um very thin, so didn't get in the way, felt really good. All right, that's it for the review. I'll leave a link to their website in the description. I don't get any kickback or anything like that, but in case you guys wanna check them out and uh, leave a comment, let me know what you want me to review next. Probably need to do some trucks. So uh, yeah, leave a comment and I'll see you guys in the next video.